All right, Eddie, welcome back. What does a 2.02% yield on the 10-year Treasury mean to you? So the bigger picture to us, and this is something we've been talking about to your viewers and clients, is the bond market has been sending warning signals that I think many have been ignoring. Look at the twos and tens. The yield spread is starting to tighten, okay? And when you have that happen right before a Fed starts accelerating their rate hikes, because the Fed only affects the short-term rates, they are now in a position where they may have to force a recession by inverting the yield curve to, to calm down the inflation. The inflation data continues to get hot. And now with the Russia-Ukraine issue, it's accelerating the inflationary problems with natural gas and oil. So they are in an impossible position here where if they tighten like they say, we're going to be into a recession potentially. And if they do nothing, we could potentially be in a recession because inflation is going to go through the roof and kill the consumer even more. I don't know how you run your business. Do you tell your clients or do you advise your clients what to do or do you control their money anyway and you do it for them? We do it for them, but we also communicate the changes that we're doing for them. I just did an event yesterday for our clients and we were crystal clear in regards to what our market prognosis was for the next six months. And look, it's not easy to go out and make these bold calls, but our clients pay us to not sugarcoat anything. The bottom line is we haven't seen poor economic setup like this in more than 40 years. So I can't sit here and do nothing for our clients when the data is smacking us in the face that we are going to be decelerating economically and the Fed is so late to the game, they have to raise rates during that slowdown. I just hope you get it right, Eddie. You've been right so far and we'll see you again soon.